hook into the center of the flashing light for the moment. Laser eye surgery has been around in many different forms for many, many years. Early work was done by Professor Barakay. He was one of the pioneers in refractive laser eye surgery, and it's from his pioneering work that laser eye surgery was born. So we have over 50 years worth of experience in refractive eye surgery. Specifically, when it comes to using a laser to do the shaping of the eye, as opposed to, in the older days, a more mechanical approach to shaping the eye, laser surgery was introduced about 20 to 25 years ago. And it was first formulated by Professor John Marshall, who patented the idea of using an Exama laser to reshape the eye because of the accuracy of the Exama laser itself. Over the years, we've obviously gone through a lot of different protocols, and in the initial days, we used to work mainly on the surface of the eye, known today as PRK. Um, and subsequently, through better understanding, we found that the healing rates would be a lot quicker when doing a lot of the laser shaping underneath a thin corneal flap. And that's where the modern-day technique of LASIK was born. In the literature, we have long-term results already, uh, going back over 15 years, documenting good stability of patients with no adverse effects um, over that long period of time. <laughs> wow. And patients are continuing to enjoy their good vision over many, many years. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> you sure you have got lenses in my eyes? <laughs>